Hi everyone. Today we're going to be showing you the new face-to-face -face learning remote. It's called the Smooth Operator. Now, it's a pretty straightforward process, but I want to run you through the whole thing. Pretty much this is a Merlin 230T motor that is uh, not programmed by any button on this RCM11 or on the new Smooth Operator F2F learning remote. So as you can see, I can push any button on the remote and the motor does not operate. Now what we're going to do first is we're actually going to clone the code out of the RCM11 into the Smooth Operator remote. So the first thing you want to do is you want to put the Smooth Operator remote into a learning process. Pretty straightforward. So you pretty much push and hold button one on the remote and then you want to push button two four times. One, two, three, four. And as you can see, the LED will go off and then start blinking at you. What that's telling you is it's now in learning mode and it's trying to receive code from another remote. So from there, what you do is you want to push and hold button one, release, and as you can see, the LED's gone solid, and then you push the button that you want to program it to. So in this case, it would be button one. And then from there, the next step is you pretty much want to program the remote to your motor as you normally would. So you would take your face-to-face -face learning remote with button one programmed as RCM11. You then want to come over to your motor. You want to push and hold the learn button until you start here, the click. There's the click, release. Push a button on the remote that you want to program, being button one, once, release. Confirm the button that you're programming. And then test the remote. It's as easy as that. Now this remote here can take four channels. So if you happen to have four different types of remotes, you could learn one to each button and then program them all to the motor. It's a very good, easy product to use and uh, pretty straightforward, pretty easy. And that's it done, thanks guys.